Hello. So last night I created a new Rails app using the Rails main branch, and I created a few static pages in the home controller, landing page, pricing, and admin. And the admin page requires HTTP basic authentication to access it. And I added the links to these pages uh, in my layout file. So now here is my basic app, but here is something curious. Now each time I hover on the pricing or on the admin, it actually makes a GET request to get this page. So let me demonstrate once again. I hover on pricing and each time I get a request and in the network tab I get a response for the whole pricing page. And why does this happen? Well, um, recently there was this insta-click behavior that was added to Turbo 8. Uh, so it's going to be a default behavior in Turbo. In a follow-up PR it was made uh, uh, default. And what is this insta-click behavior? Well, it is inspired on this uh, InstaClick uh, JavaScript library that makes the assumption that when a user hovers on a link, he is uh, likely to click this link. So uh, the link will start loading the moment the user hovers on the link, but not when he clicks it. So it makes the perceived uh, load uh, of the page faster. So here are a few examples of uh, the speed of loading a normal link and a link that starts loading the moment you hover on it. And uh, well, this one is supposed to be uh, faster. Uh, yes, so uh, going back to our app, uh, each time when we hover on the pricing page, it makes uh, a request to the pricing. And uh, well, we don't want to make uh, this uh, load in screen visible each time we hover on admin. So let's disable it. If we go into the merge pull request here, I actually found some examples of how this uh, uh, prefetch or instaclick behavior can be disabled. So uh, here we can add data turbo prefetch false attribute. Let's try doing this. We can do it to the whole uh, div around the links. Let's try doing this. I will refresh. And now, whenever I hover on any of the links, it does not make a prefetch. Let's instead try disabling it only for the admin link. Let's uh, go to the link to admin and say uh, data turbo prefetch false. Now, uh, when I hover on the pricing page, it makes a prefetch, but when I hover on the admin, it does not make a prefetch. And uh, then, what are the rules like what pages are prefetched, what uh, pages are not prefetched? Well, if I go to the pricing page and hover back on it, it does not make a prefetch. If I hover on the home page, that is a different URL, it does make a prefetch. It will also not make prefetches on uh, non-get requests. So, if I have uh, something like uh, a link to pricing, uh, data, to ball, method, post, then uh, it is uh, not supposed to make uh, a request. Let me go back to home page. I hover on normal pricing, I make the request. I hover on pricing post and it does not make uh, a request. It will also not make this kind of prefetch request for buttons too. So it doesn't make a request for current page, for non-get uh, requests and for external URLs. So let's uh, try adding link to superrails.com and add the HTTPS superrails.com So uh, if I hover on uh, pricing it makes uh, this prefetch if I hover on superrails.com it does not make a prefetch so looks uh, quite good now I was also wondering it uh, doesn't make uh, sense that each time I hover on the pricing, it uh, makes a new request. There should be like some kind of a time uh, uh, that the link is stored in the cache, in the cache, so that I don't make a request each time. And uh, actually, looking uh, at the pull requests, I found a really good explanation here in this closed pull request, where Afkapel uh, Alberto uh, explains that uh, something can change uh, in this link between you the time you uh, hovered out of it and clicked it so let's say uh, uh, the pricing changed uh, since you moved out like uh, a record was deleted so it will not already be the same page so if you 
uh, you also want to you always want to see the most up to date data, and that's why uh, uh, this uh, link is not cached for a certain period of time. But uh, each time you hover, it makes a new request. So uh, I think it's an interesting behavior that you should uh, enable on some links and, and disable on other links. Actually, you can also completely disable this uh, kind of prefetch uh, by adding a meta tag. I think uh, it would be something like uh, uh, meta uh, name uh, turbo prefetch and uh, content equals false. So uh, if I do this, now I hover on uh, pricing or anywhere else and uh, I have completely disabled this uh, turbo prefetch uh, or insta click behavior in my application. So you decide where you need it and where you don't need it. And uh, have a great day. Goodbye.